What's up, you guys? It's your girl Queen, and welcome back to another video. So, guys, in today's video, I will be doing a Valentine's Day makeup look. I know you guys said I, did, I don't have to put on makeup because I'm already beautiful already. I know that. But I am a makeup artist. And I, as I said before, I don't want only men on my channel. I want women. And me doing makeup probably would inspire a lot of women to come and watch me. So today I'm going to do a Valentine's Day makeup look. I'm going to try to attend my Valentine's Day makeup look. I don't really wear makeup like that like i don't really need really, really wear makeup like that only when i'm going out and it's have to be a big occasion for me to put on a makeup because makeup take a lot of time when it comes to me because i have to do it well you get what i'm saying so i don't really wear a lot of makeup but today i'm going to do a makeup like a valentine's day makeup look okay make sure you guys like comment and of course subscribe i also want to say thank you guys for all the love you've been showing me um i'm supposed to be at 904 subscribers i think and i really 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 appreciate this i really appreciate it. you guys I cannot even imagine how much i appreciate you guys and i want to say thank you and continue to support me whether i'm doing makeup what i'm doing try and alls what I am doing just an everyday vlog it don't matter just support me to the fullest you get what I'm saying so <laughs> yes make sure you guys follow me on Instagram at it's just underscore melanin and guys you need you guys need to follow me on Instagram because that's where you guys would keep updates with me or if you guys want me to do any videos and stuff you guys can go over to my Instagram and DM me all the ideas you guys have. If you guys want to send me a little money, money is money. Or if you guys want to send me anything like token or just anything. You know, just gifts, anything. You guys can go DM me on Instagram and let me know. As I always said, you, as I always told you guys to follow me on Instagram. And it's just underscore Melanie. It just underscore melon i'll put it up up, up under what this thing name the screen <laughs> and on my beauty page at dc beauty um underscore and this intro is way too long so let's get straight into the video so guys i am going to cleanse my face i am going to use a wipes and this wipe is the uh, ultra compact waterproof makeup wipes I'm going to use it to clean the face remember to always go up upwards it's very important And to be honest guys, I am just freestyling. I don't really know what kind of look I'm doing. I'm just going to do something relating to Valentine's. So after I cleanse the face with the wipes, I am going to moisturize. And this is the Clean and Clear Duo Action Moisturizer. Oil free. So them say. And I have an oily face. So I am going to just a little bitty bits because even though they say it's oil free I know somewhere they put a little tip of oil mm. guys after I do that after I do that guys sorry after I do that I am going to do my eyebrows guys if you hear like I saw it's because I live near a welding place so 
a welding place so yeah that's why the noise but guys um I am going to do my eyebrows I am going to do my eyebrows and today we are going to use our eyebrow pencil and our spoolie I bought this off Amazon it named best I think it named best top or best look I don't remember but anything when you're doing makeup you must go upwards I'm looking in a mirror guys so I have a lot of bump on my face. I work hard to get these bumps off my face, but I guess coming back up. So today we are going to use a brown eyebrow pencil. I don't know the name of it because the name is Erase. And whenever you're doing your eyebrows, it has to be in brown unless unless you are doing a colored eyebrow i was gonna do a colored eyebrow today but i'm not going to i'm not i'm not doing it anymore so we're gonna use the brow pencil i am making sure that it is nice that i can see it because some of these brow pencils it it, it is really um some of the, sh the brow shades pencil shades it blend in with your skin um, complexion sometimes it's too exact as a skin complexion when you just want it to be a little bit darker you get what I'm saying so And guys remember your brows should never be bigger than your actual brows never We're going to blend in, blend in the ear. Light strokes, guys. So guys, after you draw on your brows, you are going to use a concealer to You're going to use a concealer to kind of shape up the brows in a better way. And today I am going to use my LA Gale Pro Concealer in the shade Beautiful Bronze. Let me show you guys. And your concealer must be two shades lighter than your actual skin color. Guys, sometimes I don't really like to use the two shades lighter because it's hard to blend, harder to blend. But sometimes I use either my shade or something close to my shade. And you're gonna use a flat concealer brush to highlight. So we're gonna dip it on the tip of the brow brush concealer brush we are going to follow the line
you guys realizing I am using the tip I'm not using the flat part I'm using the tip Guys, trust me, when you're doing this, you have to be well focused. <laughs> Then with that remaining product, you you drag it down onto the onto the lids. And use your finger to blend out the access. We're going to do the top.
Look at that, guys. Look at that. We're going to blend it out with our hands. So guys, I'm going to do the next one off camera. So guys, the bros are finished. Look at it. It's perfect. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I am going to do... I'm going to prime. I'm going to prime my eye, my eyelids. And I'm going to use the Elegate Pro Concealer in the shade Cool Tan. Guys, to be honest, I don't know what look I'm doing. I'm not I'm using red. And that's it. That's it, I know. I know I'm using red. But that's just it. I'm using red. Anyways, we are going to figure it out as we go along. Oh, we're, going to use a we're going to use our concealer brush to just spread it out. I actually have two mirrors. I have one in front of me and this little one. Sometimes I forgot I have this little one in my hands. So the reason for us, the reason why I'm priming the eyes, the eyelid, is to, it's because I want, when I put on my eyeshadows, it pops. That's the reason for priming the eyes. I'm going to do the next side and get back to you guys. So guys, I already primed the eyes and I blend it out. So I'm gonna I'm gonna put um piece of cellophane tape on the side of my eyes right here so I can get like a precise um um angle. If you're doing like a wing like or you just want a, a straight um, line, a straight angle, I suggest you use a cellophane tape from the corner to about right here. One minute guys okay guys so I add on the cellophane tapes guys to be honest they are uncomfortable but beauty is uncomfortable right 
Okay, guys, we are going to use. Uh, let's see where we're going to start from. Yeah. Yes, guys, yes. So, we are going to use this brush. Never tired of dirty, guys. I'm just gonna wipe it in some um the leftovers in the wipes. Look at this, voila! So we're going to use the Crown Pro, the Crown Pro palettes today, right? Right. And we are going to use. We're going to use this reddish brownish shade as our translucent color. And we're going to do it in the inner corner of the eye. I don't really do eyeshadow on myself all that much. So, yeah. so I tend to try one and two times, you know, with the shadows. But I don't really do it a lot. But this shade is popping, it's popping. Get the outer part a little bit brighter. And then we're going to do it to the other side. I'm going to see guys. I am going to So you see the left side is always going to do perfect. Nothing is perfect, but the left side is always going to do better than the right. Trust me. I'm a left-handed person. And I'm always trying to get this, the both sides equal. Always. Like right now. I'm gonna try to get close. Get a nose. Get a contour. Look. to the next side. Hold well on guys. Okay guys, after we put on the translucent color, I tried to get it to be um you know on the edge of the nose. Now we're good. But after we use the translucent color we are going to go in to our hold on guys, may I pick up this? 
into our Brazilic, take me back to into our BH, take me back to Brazil palettes. And we are going to go in with our red. Not doing too much, guys, to be honest. I'm going along as I as I I am just going along. I'm going along. I'm just doing thing. Doing it. And we are going to use this this cut this red. Right red. I we're just gonna use it all over the eyes. I think I need to put some more of this on my eye. Does it go away? Are you guys seeing me? Because I am not. I'm going to cut the crease. Instead of just packing on the, black, the red, I am going to cut the crease. Guys, I am going to cut the crease, okay? Let's see if we can get it <laughs> like that one, guys. Okay, guys. We are definitely going to. We are definitely going to shape up that with the concealer. Okay, hold on. So, guys, we are going to clean it up.
then you're going to spread it All right, guys, let's see if we can get the next side as this one. We are going to. We have to be positive, right, guys? Positivity. Right. One minute guys so guys we did that cut crease it took longer than I thought but we done it <laughs> we are finished all right now guys so we are going to go back so we are going to go back in with the red and we are going to put the red all over the cut crease part All right, let's hope oh, this pigment is up. Okay guys, it's absolutely working.
So guys, I didn't just use the red to get this look. I used this one, this bronzish color like. Guys, I'm using leaving this little part for a white shade. So, okay guys, after we do that, we are going to, I wanted to put glitter on the eyes, glitter, I wanted to put some red glitter on the eyes, so we are going to do just that. It's, it's actually a, a nail heart thing I get into a um, an acrylic set. I got it in an acrylic set. But, you know, I decided that I'm going to use it to do my eyebrows. My eyes. It's called Color Curving Pattern Powders. So guys, I went and did the glitter on the eyes. I went and did the glitter on the eyes, guys. And I use I use a lip gloss as the adhesive. I use the lip gloss as the adhesive. I use this lip gloss as the adhesive. Wait, wait, I'm gonna tell you the name. It's vitamin C waterproof and shine lip gloss. Okay guys, I am going to do my liner. Guys, my cinema is for too long. <laughs> I'm going to do my eyeliner. I'm going to use the MAC. I think it's MAC. It's it rub up. Pen liner.
I'm gonna die, guys. Okay guys, my wing is finished. Hold on, I'm gonna that one, okay? So guys, finish through the eyes. Finish through the eyes. One thing left for do is to put on. I push on lashes, and we are going to do that last. But otherwise, from that, we're finished with the eyes. We are going to do our phone day shop. I'm going to do our foundation and I'm going to use I am going to use a concealer for my foundation today because I don't have my shade yes guys so I'm going to use this foundation this concealer in the shade cool oh beautiful brands and i'm using my beauty blender And remember, pat, pat, pat. Don't drag, pat. Guys, my, it's finishing. No. My concealer is finishing.
I don't want to look like a mask. We don't. So, I'm getting it down on the neck, on the ears, so it doesn't look like a mask. And my mouth, you must lay up. Always lay up. Okay, guys, we are finished with that. So, we are going to... Let me fix my brows, guys. Okay. So, we are going to highlight... I want my nose contour to start. I'll go over a little more. Okay, guys, so when you're highlighting, you must use it. Something two shade lighter than your foundation. going to highlight under here So we're going to blend out this. I was thinking about letting it sit on my face for a bit, but I'm contemplating. Nah. I'm going to use this brush to blend it out.
Because my right is supposed to be blending with a bro, um, a... Well, it actually can... You can blend it out with anything, right? But I usually use... I usually use a, a, a beauty blender or a beauty sponge. But you see guys, it's true, I already put my foundation into my beauty blender. I didn't want to risk it you get wrong, to blend it with the beauty blender and I know that when I'm finished I know that when I'm finished blending out the highlight I always go in back with that same foundation sponge or brush to kind of blend out the eyeliner the highlight, the highlight the arch edges right but that's I didn't want to use but the beauty blender so guys we are going to contour we're going to contour we are going to use the crown palette to contour we're using this brow the persons who don't know where to contour you just go like this That's how you find where to contour. So after you contour, guys, I am going to put on some blush. Some blushy today. I feel like for a pink, pinkish. Should I do pink or should I do red? I'm gonna do red. I'm gonna use the same red that I use on my eyes for the blush. And if you don't know where to put your blush, you just smile. And this is where it goes. You just smile, apply. Smile and apply. So, yes, guys, after we do that, I'm going to put a little bit of bronze on my face. Just a little bit. I'm gonna use this shade. Oh! Oh my god. I said a little bit. I look at it. So, what are we gonna do? We are going to brush out the excess and then blend it all back. It's too much. Okay, now it's time, now it's time to set the face, to set all the parts we highlighted and contour, we are going to set. Oh, and we're using the Maybelline, the Maybelline Fit Me foundation in the shade Deep 35. We are just going to go like this, go like this here. Um, we are going to set Mm -hmm. 
and then we are going to do it with the contour part so big chop a big chop right a big chop a big chop Then after we do that, we are going to we're going to dust off the axis, right? And then we are going to go in with that same foundation sponge that we are going to, you know away the arch lines mm -hmm. okay we are done with that I know let me let me just touch up about the white let me just touch up about the white part of the eyes kind of fading there we go okay both after we do that commercial break don't forget to drink your boom to get boom up <laughs> all right guys after we do all of that we are going to put on our lash so guys hold on wow we long so guys i have two packs of lashes right and i'm gonna show you them right now this is up shadow one i feel like this one will go with the look option two what you guys think about this lash from sheen what you guys think one or two i feel like this seems more dramatic than this one yeah sorry yeah, i'll go with this one guys <laughs> I'm gonna go with this one. Okay, and this is my first time using them, so. Oh, for the best. Of the best. Of the best. Of the best. Guys, the place is a mess. You want to see the place? Guys, you want to see the place? It's a mess. So, guys. I'm just fitting trying I'm just fitting it fitting the lashes to see if it's one to cut down or if it's okay. To be honest it's okay. Would it make the look?
I feel like hold on I'm gonna use I'm gonna take out piece one of these and see oh no I'm very indecisive guys I have to make this look absolutely fabulous We're gonna see which one fits the look. This one. Yes, this one. This one gives me a little bit more dramatic and it's kind of hiding the eyeshadow. I don't want that. So we are going to use this sort. Okay guys, so we are going to use this one. Let me do the fitting. I need to drop myself in the eye, guys. So, guys, we are using the, the Ida Beauty Waterproof Warm Lash Glue. Oh god. It says dry fast. So let's do this. Get it to be a little bit tacky. Tacky mama. So guys, oh you like my look so far? I like it. I did great. 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 Mm. I did great. Uh. Okay, we are going to apply it. Oh, my back, guys.
right guys, I finally get the eyelashes on. Finally get the lashes on, I was still. Guys, the glue, what is the glue? Guys, I need to get good lash glue. Anyways, we are using the long, long at last She Glam at Sheen mascara. Okay, we did that. <laughs> we did that. Okay. Anyways, anyways, guys, we are going to finish this off with a lip. We're finishing this off with the lip. I we're using eyebrow and, um eyebrow pencil. You're gonna put some red underneath the under eye. We're gonna do the lips now, guys.
scream. <laughs> All right, guys, we are going to put on some red lip lip. I'm going to put on some red lipstick. You say I'm the prime minister, and then you have a way. I got a line of the we country. What is that, guys? Mm -mm, guys, don't leave this at cock up, so. Okay guys, we're gonna put a little gloss on this. I'm a little dry up. Right there, guys. Right, right there. All right, guys, we're gonna put on some highlighting and then we are through with this makeup. We're gonna use this one, this gold shade, and this fan brush. Put it right here. I don't want it too light. Flip it over and blend it out.
Oh, we'll put that on the lip. No, we're not put that on the lip. All over the brows. Yeah, go do it. <sighs> True, guys. Okay, guys. We are going to set this thing. Oh, we are using the makeup setting spray matte finishing. Them say it long lasting. Ready? Oh shit. <laughs> that spin guys. That perfume, guys. So we're gonna use this and kind of press in. So you know, it really lasts for long. We're going to press it in, guys. And we are finished hold on so guys this is the end of the video 110 days later i hope you guys enjoy this video i hope i'm not too quiet or too or so too confusing at the same time but guys i hope you guys enjoy this video i hope you guys enjoy your valentine day and if you guys like this video if you guys like these videos you guys comment down below and let me know or just click the like button that would signify you guys like the video and make sure you guys follow me on instagram at it's just underscore melanin and on my business page at dc beauty glam underscore and as i said in the intro thank you guys for 905 or so subscribers I really really appreciate it. My soon reach 1000. When I reach 1000 guys, I am going to go live. So run it up, run it up, run it up for me guys. And yeah, see you guys in the next video. Bye iPhone 1. I'm gonna try and I'll send me some money. Peace.